do more. My fur has started to thicken in the anticipation of winter as the nights grow. sneak forward and I spy a small rabbit drinking from a stream It was a chilly day, but my dear winter still had not come. In the, res in the reflection of the stream, I can see ice.
just for the short moments of childhood. Alone, wandering in the woods of winter. That is where my heart has always been. across the forest and the wolf moon would shine it would shine to show me the way I would howl with how beautiful she is in the
was broken, saying goodbye. Movement to my side caused my mind to snap back to the current moment. The hair on my back started to rise. And I turned to see what was coming. A black shape started to form out of the darkness. Dark fur. stared into my brother's eyes and growled. Identical eyes stared back at me and a similar growl emanated from the shadow's throat. snow season as a shadow he only loves the night he only has doubt and fear and was suspicious of my lady winter and thought little of her white dress showing up to attack, try to steer my wandering to its own ends, or beat me back to try and make me give up on my dream of winter. I will not let my shadow steer. I started to run, my dark brother, right behind. He bit at me and tried to steer me this way and that. each other. Blue eyes locked, locked into one another. I could see my destruction within the dark wall. If I lose my will, stare increased as time went on. The darkness of night soon started to close in around us. Clouds started to Thank you.
temperature started to drop, showing my breath deep and warm, streaming into the night. My brother grew larger as the night took hold. I gathered my strength. As I started to doubt, I felt like I was going to lose, and the darkness was overtaking me. He had me locked in his power. As I started to doubt, I would ever beat the darkness. A snowflake fell and rested on my nose. each other and circled, living, leaving paw prints on the freshly fallen snow. My darkness stood out struck out at my shadow. My black brother. The dark wolf shrunk with every bite and was soon reduced to back to just a small shadow of doubt. Once again, a silent
store. And after a long walk, I came to a clearing. There in the center of the clearing was a large stone surrounded in snow. bit of strength, I worked my broken body on top of the stone and held my owl was so was strong and sad, bounced off the hill. spoke of pain and sorrow, as well as relief and joy. My dearest winter had come to see me. in my head in her lap. Cooling the heat and pain throbbing through my body. My blue eyes locked Just as my hairdress has hidden you and protected you in seasons past, I will heal and protect you now. She looked upon the darkness I carried with me. A snarling shadow shaped from the moonlight, her mind transferred more words to me through her emerald gaze. The black wolf you carry with you, the damage
shadow you carry is part of you. In one arm, she effortlessly hoisted my broken body. In the other arm, she held my snarling shadow. helped 